Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So this is a makeup look that I created for a girl's day out. This is a very simple, easy, quick uh, makeup look using all affordable makeup products. So if you want to know how I achieved this easy peasy quick makeup look for going out, then please do continue watching. First thing first, I love to use my Dermabibe Hydra Cleanser to clean my face to get rid of all the dirt and impurities. Then I took the Nutiderm Vitamin E Moisturizing Lotion to hydrate my skin further. So I'm just taking a generous amount of the moisturizer and applying that all over the face and neck. And this just helps my makeup to sit so properly and provides the right sort of hydration to my skin. Now moving on to the base makeup, I'm first taking the L'Oreal Infallible Lasting Primer. This is one of my favorite primers for my oily skin type so I'm just applying a little bit of the primer on the main areas of the face and blending it out using my fingertips. This is a really good oil controlling um, and long lasting primer for oily skin types. Then I took my Pack Take Cover Concealer in the shade Rusty Orange which is basically like an orange color corrector. And just applying that wherever I have hyperpigmentation such as the dark circles, hyperpigmentation around my mouth, the acne spots and a little bit around my nose area. So after applying the color corrector, I'm just going to take a damp beauty blender and just blend out the color corrector. I'm not going to use any liquid foundation or concealer for today's look. This is going to be super quick and easy. So I'm going to pick up a compact powder with a good coverage in it. So I'm picking up the LA Girl Pro Face HD High Definition uh, Matte Press Powder in the shade Warm Tan, I guess. I'll put the exact name in the description box. And also I'm going to take my setting spray. This is the Milani Make It Last Setting Spray and spraying that on my damp beauty blender a couple of times. And then I'm going to pick up the compact powder and apply that all over the face. This is sort of going to lock the compact powder with the skin and this is going to help your makeup to last longer as well because of the setting spray um, used on the sponge. Now to add a bit of definition on the face, I'm using the Sugar Cosmetics Contour De Force Mini Bronzer and this is in the shade Caramel Captain. This is such a good um, affordable contouring powder for deeper complexion. So I'm just applying that to the hollows of the cheeks. Um, sort of on the perimeters of the face so applying a little bit on the forehead on my jawline and also going to use the same powder um, on my eyelids as a crease color as well as to contour my nose a little bit. To add a flush of color to my cheeks, I'm going to take my current favorite blusher from K by Katrina in the shade Soft Nude and just applying that to the apples of my cheeks. This is such a beautiful deep peachy nude color. Then I'm going to take this Mars Cosmetics um, highlighter in the shade Stardust and this is such a beautiful power packed highlighter so I'm just taking a very very tiny amount and just applying that to add a bit of glow to my face. Now I'm going to fill in my eyebrows using the Lacme Absolute Micro Brow Definer and this is in the shade Charcoal. This has a very very thin pencil so it's easy for you to um, mimic any hair like strokes on the eyebrows. So I'm just using that to fill in any gaps and giving my eyebrows a nice shape. For eyeliner, I'm taking the Forever 52 Purest Waterproof Ink Eyeliner. So this is like a sketch eyeliner, so I'm just using that to create a winged eyeliner on both my eyes. I was feeling like adding a winged eyeliner um, on this day, so yeah, that's what I went for. For mascara, I'm again taking Forever 52 Volume Lashes Mascara. So this has got a big wand and I'm just applying a few coats of this mascara to my top and bottom eyelashes and this does add a nice amount of volume to your lashes. For lipstick, I'm mixing these two lipsticks from Eba Cosmetics. This is their Max Matte Liquid Lipstick. 
So first I'm taking that um, sort of like a toffee brown shade and just applying that all over the lips and this formula is a very very good comfortable liquid lipstick formula and lasts pretty well on the lips as well. And on top of that I'm using the more pinkier shade and just mixing them both together to create a custom color for myself. Now to fix everything in place, I'm using the Milani Make It Last Fixing Spray again and just spraying that all over the face. This is just going to make sure that the makeup doesn't budge and stays longer throughout the day. And here is the final finished look. And this is what I wore for a girl's day out with one of my friends. So in a couple of seconds, you'll just see a short vlog. So if you want to see the vlog, please continue watching. I was back from a very very long day and my skin was very very sweaty at that moment so I'm gonna take my Derma Vibe Hydra cleanser once again to clean off my uh, makeup from the skin and then I'm gonna take the Dr. Shed's Haldi and Hyaluronic Acid Sleeping Mask this is like a serum for your skin basically which adds a lot of hydration to the skin so I've taken a generous amount of that uh, serum and just applying that all over the face to add a nice amount of hydration and glow to the skin. Once that is completely absorbed, I'm going to take the basic brightening vitamin lotion from Dr. Shets and this is like a very liquidy lotion for your skin and this has got a lot of vitamin C to it so it's just going to help in brightening up your skin and this is just going to make sure that your skin is more brightened and clear and also adds to the glowiness of the skin. So I'm just applying that all over the face and neck again and then I'm going to go to sleep and this is how my skin looks after my nighttime skincare routine really fresh and clean and squeaky so yeah this is it for today's video i really hope that you guys enjoyed watching it if you did make sure to give it a huge thumbs up comment and do not forget to subscribe to my channel for more such videos and take care of yourselves and i shall see you guys soon in my next one bye